Hey everyone, Zef here, and welcome to Blade and Sorcery Nomad Overview. I'll give it to y'all, this is a pretty big release for Quest. We're not having a lot of physics driven games recently, if it's due to the hardware or just the complexity of coding, because it is not easy, I imagine, to develop a full scale combat system, so this should be interesting. So, Blade and Sorcery Nomad is a standalone version of the original title from the PC VR, though with a couple changes. Obvious one is the graphics, I mean, every game porting to Quest will be downgraded, some more some less. It has included dungeons, which I believe is the most recent version of the game, some special blood effects are disabled by default, lower limits of enemies on the screen, essentially everything is like being optimized while conserving the core mechanics. Apparently it's gonna come with modding, which remembering some videos, memes and stuff is a very big part of this series, so developers really made sure that people who played on the PC VR will have very much similar experience on Quest, so kudos to that. I actually never played Blade and Sorcery before, and I believe it's because of the same story as Gorn or Physical battleground I tend to get lost in sandbox scenarios because I don't really have a guidance of what to do or what are the goals of the game I know that it's all about having fun and creativity but I guess I'm just a special case that loves to have a reason to play I don't know I do however love the medieval scenario and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like the combat because that's essentially what you want full-on realistic fights with people like it can get better than that I don't know if it has something aside from sandbox I mean it has these dungeons and other maps so maybe there is some kind of content to explore for me if it's gonna be for 10 minutes or a few hours, we'll have to see, but let's just go and start killing people. Thank you for your support. Well, thank you for coming to the quest zone. Character selection and save points. Okay. Please select your game mode. It cannot be changed later. Oh. Crystal Khan is not available. Progression game mode. Oh. I feel like I would be more down for that because this seems like a campaign-ish or like storyline-ish mode and just progress. Okay, well, I'll be waiting for it for sure. So let's go sandbox. Holy hell, this model is the best one that I've seen first. <laughs> I wish that would be me. <laughs> Where we spawned? Oh, oh, oh okay, well. Already used. Oh. Okay. No explanation what's going on, but I'll just, yeah, go with the flow, I suppose. Pick my door building style. What's here? Oh, yeah. Ooh. I wonder how heavy the weapons are. Well, it is not that heavy. I think it could work with one hand. I mean, now it's like flicks my wrist if I yeah, do it too fast. Okay, so there is some kind of prevention. This is more my style. <laughs> A blurry oh <laughs> mirror. <laughs> not a lot of things are destructible, which I mean it is a physics simulator, but not like destruction simulator. Let's go to the market. I don't know. So obviously I'm not good at sandboxes. <laughs> How like shooting mechanics work here? Amazing. Yeah, this is accurate. Hello, is anyone here? Ah, there's some book. Waves. Let's do learning. Two enemies at a time. What? Shit! <laughs> oh, what the? <laughs> Calm down! <laughs> No. Whoa. Finally. <laughs> Point blank. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> Do I have to really, like, aim properly because it deflects? <laughs> Give me this. Uh. <laughs> hmm, that's not my weapon. Whoa. <laughs> 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 
ستة خمسة get out اوه Calm down. Not like that. Eat. I think I can deflect it, said. Yeah. <laughs> No, 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 no. <laughs> the weapons, like, just go. <laughs> oh, now we have fire sword, what? <laughs> There's a lot of going on for the first time. I would appreciate some kind of tutorial. Oh, we can spawn things. Nice. Okay. So how do I do anything? Mm -hmm. So when we want things in our hands, we just pull, but with a trigger. I didn't know that. Okay. Oh, here we go. Okay. Let's slow down. What the hell? <laughs> Oh, let me put infinite mana, I suppose. Oh shit. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> oh, well, hello. <laughs> Stop shooting me. <laughs> Fireballs. Can't even hit it from point blank. I guess I have to just calmly aim. Yeah. Deflect her. Oh, what the? <laughs> you are dead. Ow. I go into the water. Thank you. Yeah, sure, that works. <laughs> I'm trying to see, like, yeah, everything works with deflection and stuff like that. It's just that I can't do it really fast because then my weapons disappear or just it's getting crazy. Ow! <laughs> no. I think the off center is like a little bit to the left. Yeah. And as well, sometimes they really don't connect. I mean, they connect, but they just bounce off even though they don't have a helmet or just anything at all. <laughs> My dude, you're hardcore, just. Leaving after taking an arrow. Oh, I'm hitting him. Whoa! I think I can climb this actually. Heh, <laughs> bye bye. Oh, 
What now? Oh shit, I mean I'm gonna die <laughs> like that. No! <laughs> Swim -swim. What I wanted to do is this. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, that's amazing. They have like some dodgy. Di <laughs> no, 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 stay down. <laughs> oh, wow. Me? <Knee>? No. <laughs> What is stumbling? Okay, that's amazing level of detail. Bye. I wish I could just create some bigger fireball or something like that. Just like with gravity spell. Wow. Taking off the trash. <laughs> yeah, just bye. Aha, okay, so that's how it works. Bye! <laughs> Incoming! Just... Actually, wait, what I'm doing? Wow, it's too heavy. I think they're getting stuck after like 5th death or something. No, 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 no. Clang, 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 clang. <laughs> You're heavy. Oh no. <laughs> I thought there were dungeons or even mods available. Oh yeah, Greenland is dungeons. Okay, I didn't know that. Where are we? <laughs> Oh well. <laughs> Where's he going? I'm here, my dude. Oh, crutch shot. Jesus, they g they go like sideways. I can't properly aim for ball. Oh wow, you're hardcore, huh? Oh, ah. I guess that's the dungeon. Hello? Um, that's a court. <laughs> yeah, I'm here. What the? <laughs> they talk. <laughs> the moves. Oh wow. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> I 
<laughs> I'm teasing. Left, right, left, right. Okay then. I don't know if there's like a reward at the end or something. Jump attack, B. You will regret yeah, of course I will. I'm kind of familiar with the mechanics now. You have to take a moment, definitely. and aiming. <laughs> Shoot! Oh, <laughs> that was a distraction. <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> Are <laughs> you <even> behind you? <laughs> if no one's on the map, check your backs. I hate shields. Bye. Oh, <laughs> I saw something for a second. I guess it's like a boss stage or some sort. They just will keep spawning. Jesus. Punch you. Ah, you reeled yourself. <laughs> Potion. I don't know anything. Is it infinity? Oh. Okay. <laughs> A 
that's the end? <laughs> I think so. I mean, I chose the shortest dungeon, so that implies it's the end. Okay, I'm good for now with this. It does what it should. Sandbox, medieval, sword fighting, magic, just anything physics driven is happening here. It's definitely a thing that you have to get used to because it uses its own system. So nothing like sharp, nothing just like fastly movement. That doesn't work here. There's like attention to detail in terms of like sound effects as well. Swish, swoosh, deflecting projectiles. Like it's a full on situation here. <laughs> I think I would appreciate a tutorial though. I mean, I learned the mechanics by just trying stuff, but some little guidance would be nice. The graphics look like graphics. <laughs> I mean, it's a little bit potato-ish, but we know why. It's just quest capabilities with building physics in the game. So no surprise there, but overall it's fun. Like I'm waiting for this crystal hunt to see what's going on with that. Sandbox, as I said, it's not for me because I would play for like 20 minutes max and then just leave it be, which is just how I work nowadays. I like having a reason to play in the game. It's hard to tell if the game has few bugs still because like yeah, hands just kind of can drift while in combat and you can lose your weapons if you just swing too fast. Maybe it's because of the mechanics. Like I can't tell, but you really have to take your time and just sink in the experience, not like rushing it because it's not gonna give what you want. But yeah, we'll see how it's gonna go with this.